first of all, welcome to the Magnet Lab. Uh, this, you may know, is one of three campuses for the Magnet Lab. It's the largest, it's the headquarters. Uh, but uh, we also have, and here we do uh, DC magnetic fields. We have a large power supply. When we turn on our magnets, we use 7% of the power of the city of Tallahassee, which is a community of about 250,000 people. Um, we also have the highest field MRI uh, magnet with which we um, do uh, the highest resolution MRI where you can see individual cells and individual nerve fibers. Uh, and we're also pioneering work uh, looking at imaging elements other than just hydrogen. So where's the chlorine, where's the sodium to look at actual cell function and cell death. Um, the other two branches, one is down in Gainesville uh, where we also do MRI uh, and NMR work, as well as ultra-low temperature work, which is relevant to condensed matter physics, where you can get the electrons down to a millikelvin, and you get a very high ratio of magnetic field over KBT uh, for systems like fractional quantum Hall effect. Um, a lot of the work in helium on whether there was a super solid state was done there uh, as well. And then the third branch is out in Los Alamos, uh, where we have pulsed magnets, where you turn the magnets on and off again fast enough that they don't melt. And uh, that allows you to get to roughly twice the field that we get here. We get to 45 Teslas here, a million times the Earth's field. We get to 100 Tesla out in, in uh, Los Alamos. Um, we did notice that you brought winter weather here, um, but uh, uh, we had a drop in temperature of several tens of degrees uh, over the last couple of days. Um, I actually have, have called up on my cell phone. Uh, we are expecting much warmer weather, um, although the word winter is in the title, so it does make sense we start off in the 20s. Uh, but tomorrow it'll get up to 69, and then it gets into the 70s. And on Friday it'll get to 78 degrees. Uh, this, of course, is all archaic units of measure, um, which we do here in this country. Um, and as a, a final statement, um, I'd, on a serious note, I'd just like to note the passing of Lev Gorkov, one of the great giants in condensed matter theory. Uh, he passed away around Christmas time uh, just a few weeks ago. Uh, he came to the Magnet Lab in 1992 and uh, spent um, 24 fruitful years here as a uh, leading theorist uh, in our theory group. Uh, was creative to the end, publishing in, in uh, leading journals uh, right up to the end. And uh, for those who had the pleasure to know him personally, uh, his, his clever wit was also uh, uh, fully functioning uh, right up to the very end. And so if I could ask for just a very brief moment of silence in memory of love. Thank you very much. Hello, I'm just really delighted to welcome everybody to the MagLab Theory Winter School. Um, people have come in from all over the world, students, lecturers, and when Kevin Ingersent and Vlad and I decided to put this thing together, we went to the very best theorists in the world to talk about computation for materials design for correlated electron materials. And it's been very, very exciting. The emails that happened before the meeting and everyone coming together, the lively discussions, it's just been terrific, and uh, I hope you can look at the, we videotaped everything, and we've got lectures posted, and I hope you can enjoy this for many years to come. So welcome to the MagLab Theory Winter School.